atmosphere in the place. Let's make it nice and chilly. Or is that going to go away as soon as I talk to her? An excellent choice. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That was sneaky of you, patching in Varl and Aaron to our conversation. I am pleased you accepted their help. Is there something you wish to discuss before you depart? How's Catalo doing? I detect that the loss of his arm still deeply pains him, well, yeah. though he has not voiced his thoughts. I may be able to assist in his recovery, should he be interested. Phantom really? pain. I'm sure he will be. Hmm. Varl and Zoe seem to like spending time together. I bet they do. Indeed. Indeed. While studying old world data, Zoe discovered references to a dietary lifestyle known as vegetarianism. Veggie. Veggie. She appreciated the similarities with Utaru practices and encouraged Varl to try out this lifestyle. To which she said, fuck no. How did that go? I believe they have agreed to disagree. There you go. How's what about Aaron? Aaron? Handling things? He is becoming increasingly accustomed to use of the focus. After an initial incident. Just spilling what beer on it. He unfortunately crushed his first focus as he attempted to affix it to his temple. Amongst a number of Osaram curses. It's dainty. I believe he also it's a dainty. The focus for being It's like a Dorito. Dainty. He has given repeated assurances that it will not happen again. Well, good thing we have a lot of extras, I guess. He's so strong with his fat sausage fingers. All right, we have four months, I think. She How already said. How long do we that. have then? At present rates, without additional factors, the biosphere will cross a point of no return in approximately four months. And if I gather ether, Demeter, Poseidon, it'll buy us another couple them? months. Yeah, we, we know this. Only gain a few months more. Well. Every bit counts. Okay. Back. Alright. About the old world. So this facility, the regional control center, it was meant to oversee the terraforming system? For the local region? Yes. Had humans received their education from the Apollo database, they would have then been guided here to assume operation. As that never happened, this place remained vacant. Until Minerva decided to settle here. Huh. So I guess this room was meant to keep an eye on conditions outside? Yes. From here, the facility's operators would have been able to observe weather and machine activity in real time. Talk faster. It would be possible to restore more of this room's functionality should you find and reconnect additional camera feeds. Okay. I'll keep a lookout. Okay. Old world. So the Hades Proving Lab, where I found the Gaia Colonel. It used to be a Pharaoh research facility? Yes. Pharaoh. Prior to appropriation by Zero Dawn, the facility was used to engineer and test advanced computer viruses. It appears to have been one of many research initiatives by Pharaoh Auto. I guess it wasn't enough to build automated killing machines. He wanted viruses to infect them with too. Yeah, he's like that. So, a while back, before the battle at Meridian, I went into Banuk territory. I discovered another AI there. I don't... One not related to Zero Dawn. I don't remember this. Cyan. Was this it was created to oversee operations for a volcanic stabilization project. Science. It's been the last thousand years in isolation. I'm guessing you didn't know about it? Mm. No. From the data on your focus, it seems that Cyan was cut off from the outside world. An effort by its creators to protect it from the Pharaoh Plague. Any chance it could help us now? I have already attempted contact with no success. Given its previous experience with accepting an outside network request, I imagine it is unwilling to do so again. Right. Because last time Hephaestus enslaved it. Well, 
That's too bad. <laughs> I don't know. The two of you would have had a lot to talk about. So I don't know. I don't remember Cyan. The processor Ether was Volcanic. installed on was part of an ancient war museum. A memorial to something called the Hot yes. Zone Crisis. The, Do you know anything about it? The fighting My pen. knowledge of historical events was unfortunately lost with the Apollo database. Rodrigo However, somebody. climate data indicates a peak in regional temperatures in the 2030s. Sounds bad, Such right? conditions would see extreme prolonged droughts, an increase in dust storms, and a loss of habitable landmass. But they wouldn't have built a museum in the middle of a wasteland. So I guess things got better eventually. Zero dawn. Yes. Data suggests that temperatures return to average levels in the clawback era of the 2040s. There was an ancient tank embedded in the bulwark. Any idea how it got there? During the Pharaoh Plague, the U.S. military resumed the use of human combatants, as automated machinery was unreliable. It is possible the vehicle was part of a pre-automated war fleet. So they fought against the Pharaoh machines in the valley. Mm -hmm. Until the mountain was blasted apart and buried them. Um, why are these still lit up? So, Project Zero Dawn, the greatest minds in the world, all working to build the terraforming system while the Pharaoh Plague devoured the planet. What was it like? Personnel worked in rotations at all hours of the day. Resources and technology were secured from across the world. Within a month of the project's conception, I was launched and began my education. Elizabeth encouraged me to spend time with the rest of the Zero Dawn staff. She said it was important to experience many personalities and perspectives to aid in my emotional development. What were they like? Scared. Hopeful. Determined. They were hurtling toward technological achievements on a scale never before attempted. I owe everything to their dedication. Gaia? What was Elizabeth like? Her presence is interwoven with my memories. The moment I came online, she was there. We exchanged greetings, names, then set to our task. It was the first of many conversations. I enjoyed being in her company, listening to her stories. She was my creator. Imagine having an AI like this. Your friend. Yes. When I reviewed the data on your focus, I was saddened to learn of her fate. Mm. Though I am glad she made it home. Mm. I That's right. We went to her grave at that. To be alone. Her grave. Her grave at the end of the she first. She was okay one. with that. She gave all of herself. The only one who could. Thanks, Kaya. Okay. Was there anything else we need to talk about? Oh, why are these still? <laughs> That's where, we don't need to do this. The missing subordinate functions. All right, hold on. The missing subordinate functions. Artemis rewilded the earth with a variety of animal species. Eleuthia was responsible for gestating, nurturing, and acculturing a new generation of human beings. Apollo was tasked with preserving, organizing, and disseminating vast archives of human knowledge and cultural achievements. Unfortunately, all archived Apollo data was purged on the 2nd of February, 2066, by order of Ted Farrow. Farrow, huh? I really hate that guy. Yeah, he's a scumbag. He appears to have been pathologically narcissistic, impulsive, and unstable. Yeah, he killed everybody. And All three of the missing functions have already served their purpose, or were prevented from doing so. Do you still need them? If attainable, yes. Restoring their remaining elements Fucking, would increase who the my fuck is calling my phone density. at 340? Perhaps you will be able to procure Luthia at the SOS coordinates. Scam likely. Artemis and Apollo, however, remain unaccounted for. Alright, so we'll get them.
what can Might you tell just me about fucking Demeter? go through all this. Demeter sows, fertilizes, and tends to plant life. So once I bring it back, all the blight out there will start to get better. While permanent restoration requires the abilities of Hephaestus, I may be able to improve conditions in the region for a while. However, a word of warning. Like Aether and Poseidon, Demeter's response to my query was highly irregular. Mm. Alone and frightened, it may have taken measures to assure its security. Okay, I'll keep my guard up. What about Poseidon? We already got so, Aether. Poseidon, what do we know about it? Poseidon controls the organic and chemical composition of water resources. Once it is restored to me, I may be able to improve conditions in the regional watershed, but I must. And I can go you. underwater. Like the others, Poseidon Sudden is lost and, and frightened. Okay. It may have taken measures yes, to protect yes, itself. Yes, yes. I'll be careful. Yep. All right. One more. All right. Let's talk about what we just got with Aether. You mentioned that the superstorms have subsided. Is that Aether at work? Yes. Thanks to Aether's capabilities, weather patterns in the local region should mostly stabilize for the time being. Okay. That'll be a relief for the Tanakhs. One of their villages is still recovering after a mudslide caused the whole place to flood. I will continue to stabilize the atmosphere for as long as I can. Alright. It looks like... That, well, we just set Aether and that's still lit up, but whatever. Alright. Questions about subordinate functions is still lit up. Luthia transmission. All right, no. All right. I'll be off. Farewell for now. I imagine we can come back here and talk to her about this stuff at any time. Um, what do I have? Discs, I think. Holy shit. What room did she open? We already saw this. Oh, I just made some more, that's why. What room? Door's locked. Maybe what room? I will be able to get it open later. What room did she Gaia? open? Oh, is this, is this it? Been in here. This is the uh, why does she say, Oh, I was able to open a new room, and then I guess that was it because she's not saying anything about any of these other rooms. This is m m their bedroom. This is the lovers. That looks like one of the Utaru's land gods, like the one we killed in the sacred cave. The little plow guy. Never fully understand, but seeing something that represents life and prosperity turned into a weapon. All right, we've been in here. We've talked to him. We've used. We've we've gotten. We still need tusks and two two tusks and two horns. That's what the chief always says. All right, you be good there, Catalo. There they are. So that's just down. So I guess this is it. 